Hello everyone, I'm Christopher, and today I'm going to teach you how to transfer your mods, including your Emunan, from an old SD card to a newer SD card using NX NAN Manager. This tutorial will be beneficial to you if you're trying to upgrade from an older, slower SD card with less storage to a newer one that's much faster with more storage. There's many ways to transfer your files to a new SD card, and this is just another alternative that I thought I'd share with you guys. So let's get into it. As you can see, we have a 32 gig SD card with a 29 gigabyte Emunan setup and a one gig for the actual SD. Now, realistically, you probably wouldn't have a 29 gigabyte Emunan setup for a 32 gig SD card, but this is just for example. So we're gonna go into our SD card and we're gonna create a new folder on our desktop and we're just gonna drag all the contents of our SD card into the folder on our desktop. You're going to want to download this program, NX NAND Manager. We're going to download the zip. Then we're going to go into our downloads and we're just going to extract and drag this onto our desktop. Now we're going to open up the folder and we're going to run NX NAND Manager. We're going to select file, open drive, and we're going to select our SD card. As you can see, we have our 29 gig Emunan and all these files right here. So we're going to select the full dump and you can save it anywhere you'd like. I'm just going to save it on my desktop under full NAN. Once it's finished, we can exit out of here and close NX NAN manager. Now, as you can see on our disk manager, we're, we have a 128 gigabyte SD card on there. So now that we have the SD card that we want to transfer everything to, we're going to open up NX NAND Manager again, and we're going to select File, Open File, and we're going to select that new file that we just downloaded, wherever you saved it at. Now we're going to select Tools and Emunan Creation Tool. And as you can see here, we have SD Partition, SD File AMS, or SD File SXOS. So we're just going to select SD Partition, and you're going to want to select your SD card. And we're going to create an Emunan. And it's going to let us know that it's going to erase everything. We're just going to select Yes to continue. Now this will create our partition for our SD card and format the SD card into FAT32. We can close out of here and exit. As you can see, we have 89 gigs of our 128 SD card. So we're gonna select that. So we're gonna open up our SD card and you'll see we have Emu MMC and Emu Tendo. If the file format you use for your SD card on your Switch isn't FAT32, so for example, you use XFAT, now's the time you're gonna wanna format it back into XFAT. But before doing so, you're gonna wanna transfer you're going to want to back up the files if there are any from the SD card onto your desktop, then format. If your SD card's already in FAT32, we're just going to continue on. So we're going to highlight everything other than Emu MMC and we're going to drag it into our SD card. Now we're going to go into our Emu MMC and click on the folder that's there, ER00. And we're going to go onto our backup on our computer. We're going to select Emu MMC raw. Then we're going to drag the Nintendo folder into our SD card. Now that that's done, we can go back and we're going to edit the Emu MMC file in the Emu MMC folder. We can open that with Notepad and we're going to highlight the Emu MMC slash ER00. And we're going to copy that and paste it over the emu tendo and then we're going to write slash nintendo and we're just going to save now we can exit out of that and you're done now if you did everything and you open up your sd card and there's nothing inside it that's fine as well what we're going to do instead is just highlight everything from our backup and drag it into the sd card the results may be different for people after you create the emu nan but this is just in case you didn't have anything in your folder and if we open up disk management, we can see that the SD card has a 29 gigabyte hidden partition for our Emunan and an 89 gig partition for our SD card for all our mods. And now you've transferred your mods and your Emunan to a newer SD card. So you can plug this back into your switch and you're ready to go. If this video has helped you guys out, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for taking the time to watch my video and take it easy. Thank you.